Well, hello guys, I'm back, I'm back with another speed read, uh, reading. Okay, let's get into it. <clears throat> Are Kate and William uh, ready uh, to be king and queen if uh, Prince Charles uh, wants to step down? So let's have a look then. Three cards max. Uh, does the king think uh, Catherine and William are ready to be king and queen? Oh, yes, uh, I, I do. I think he thinks, you know, it'll make a, a, an excellent uh, king and queen. He thinks very fondly of them both. They have a, a real, uh, you know, a real uh, relationship um, and bond as well as a, a bond. So, yes, I, I, I don't think, you know, that uh, King Charles uh, believes when he's no longer king, whether that's stepping down or, you know, passing away, uh, that. William and Catherine uh, will be great and they're loved by uh, the public uh, as well. Does Catherine feel she's ready to become queen? No, not yet. She wants it to last a, a little longer, okay? Uh, a little longer. I mean, things are already been uh, busy enough. You know, and then you get to Queen. I mean, can we wait till the kids get a bit older? That's how I feel, you know. Uh, let the kids uh, become a little older. Yeah, they still need time to, to go off, you know. This is like... I know they're busy, but it's kind of like a, a resting uh, period. So, no, she wants, um, you know... The, Right, there's two things, obviously, if they become king and queen, their thoughts, you know, Catherine's thoughts are that he'd have to pass away. So that would be sad. Uh, but also, as well, that she doesn't feel uh, ready. You never do, but, you know, uh, she doesn't feel ready for the reasons I've already uh, mentioned. So, yeah, bless, you know, she wants that little family time extra. Kids, you know, wait wait for a bit. The, does uh, Prince... Uh, yeah, does Prince uh, William... Uh, feel he's ready to become king. I friggin' knew it. I've had this before, you know. Oh, it's killing me off. It's killing me off. Things won't be as they are now, you know. Things won't be uh, as they are uh, now, and I'm getting somebody else, you know, I'm getting somebody else. It could be a couple of things. It could be that someone else is king, and I can't see it being Harry. Or that there is no kingdomship, you know, that after Charles, I mean... You know, you think in another 15, 20 years, uh, the royals aren't going to be important in a world where it's all sci-fi and uh, medical, you know, medicine has changed and uh, the way we live and eat has changed. So I kind of uh, feel like that. I'll pick it up there in the uh, next speed read. Um, so, I mean, he would love, you know, Charles would love him to, but if Charles goes on, uh, uh, you know, Life's going to change for us big time, uh, big time, you know. It, you won't notice it maybe as much on year on year, but, you know, it'll be like the internet when that first come out. Nobody wanted to know, they weren't interested. And now, you know, it, it's used daily by us, you know. Our phones could be stitched to our hands because it's always in it, you know. Um, yeah, I, I get that, so... Oh dear, I didn't like that. But I got it before as well. Exact uh, question. And it's always, I've often thought about it, thinking, well, who could be king or will there be a king? You know, so. Um, does does uh, William feel ready? No, I, um, 
no, I don't think he feels uh, ready. And probably for the same reasons as uh, Catherine, because they discuss things, uh, they have a conversation, you know. Um, and so, yeah, uh, that's how I feel, but a bit extra there, okay. All right, guys, uh, onwards and upwards to another speed reading, okay. I'm back in a minute. Ha, ha, ha.